um, this might be easy. Like you might be like, oh, why are you making a tutorial like this? Well, look, some people are just beginning in this software and they want to learn things. Just because you know something doesn't mean everybody knows it, right? So, I mean, I know how to do this, but some people might not know how to do it. So this is a video for those people who are new to the software. So, um, yeah, so let's say you want to rewind this clip right here. So it's playing forward, right? And you want to like reverse the clip. So you can reverse the whole thing if you want. Um, or you could just, um, like in my case, I want to just uh, reverse a part of it just for demonstration purposes. So I go right here and I click B, the blade tool, I cut. I go right here again, B. I, so I'm going to reverse this part right here. And then I press A to go back to the selector tool. Click on the clip. And then um, you go right here. So you go to this little thing right here that looks like a dashboard, okay? That's the retimer tool right here. So you click that and you just go to reverse clip. Bow. And ladies and gentlemen, it's reversed. So that's how you do it. And uh, if you want to bring it back to normal, you can probably either command Z, bring it back to normal. If that's the last um, thing you did, bring it back to normal. Or um, let's say it was um, in reverse. You can just go back to the, t the thing again right here, the tool, and just go to, um, you know, reverse clip again. So bow. And then it's going to go back to just normal. Or if you want, when you become a pro, you can just, let's say, let's zoom in some here, right? You can just click on this little thing, right? This arrow, bow, and you can do it in there, okay? Um, then you can also go here and pretty much do the same thing, reverse or forward, same thing. And you can even change the frame rates and stuff like that. So with that said, thank you for watching, guys. I'll see y'all in the next video, and that's that. And then um, blade two, bow, cut that. A2 selector. Okay, so you click on the clip again. Let's just maximize it for you guys. Since I know you're gonna be watching on a smaller um, screen on YouTube. So yeah, so click on it. So, and then just do the rewind again. Go bow here and then reverse the clip. There we go. Bow. She catches it, see? So what you could do also is, um, let's do this. So press option, hold this and move it. It's gonna like um, duplicate the, whatever the clip. So let's just make this, um, let's make, all right, so let's make this normal and then we'll rewind it here, right? So it's already in rewind mode, right? So let's bring it back to normal. Okay, uh, custom, let's go forward. Okay, so we're going forward, throws it, bow, and then it goes back again in the hands. So you see, so you could do like cool things with the rewind, you know, and you can also speed it up and stuff like that. So that's all you, that's mostly all you can do, but you can do a lot of things, but I'm just saying, and then now, uh, yeah, you go here and then just make this fast. Uh, we'll do eight, go bow. That was quick. You didn't catch that, right? Anyway, so you can do a lot of things with um, the retiming tool right here. Okay, um, so that's what I do at weddings. I usually, um, you know, use it for the, like, just to, it depends on the wedding and my edit. I can want to do that and, you know, but mostly I, I usually like slow motion it from right here. And then I just B, bow, okay, A, bow, and then command R is going to bring up this bar where you can like retime. Uh, so if you don't want to go here, bow, you can just um, click the clip you want, bow, and just press command R. It's going to bring up these settings where you, uh, this green bar where you can, you know, um, you know, retime the clip and all that stuff. So you can press command R to um, close that green part or you can press it to bring it up instead of going there. So now that's when you become more advanced, right? You could do those shortcuts like that. And then, um, so what I do is um, I do this. So right here where she throws it, and then I just slow motion it, bow, slow mode of 50%, okay? So you could do cool things like that with the retirement too. 
and I also use it for the dance scenes a lot as well. So I'm gonna lower this volume because I don't wanna get copywritten, right? But you know the song that, from the gestures, you're gonna know what song this is. Okay, that's that YMCA song. So, bow, bow. So, mm, 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 right there, bow. Okay, A, press the thing, go to Command R. Now that we're advanced, right? Now that we're getting advanced, we don't wanna go here. We wanna just like, you know, we're advanced, so shortcuts now. So Command R brings up this little thing here. Uh, let's um, zoom in some, click it, and then just, um, you can slow more it. Or in this case, we're doing the rewind, so you can rewind, reverse the clip. Bow, and you've reversed the clip. And if you want, you can change um, the speed here when you, um, uh, usually, like I said, I do 50%, but it's up to you, okay? So, bow. So, there you go. So, you just like, we just reverse the clip. So, what you can do, like I said, um, just um, hold on here. Uh, option, hold um, the, hold the clip. Press option, hold the clip, and just like, you know, so we've duplicated the clip, right? So uh, we want this one to go normal. So we can just go and just press forward. So we want this one to be normal, and then this one to bring it back. So this is, I think, already brought back, I think. Let me see. Command R, yeah, it's in reverse. So we go like that. Bow, 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 and then he does it again. So you can do cool things with the you know, retiming too and stuff like that. Reverse, slow down clips and stuff like that. So guys, that's my tutorial today. I know um, it's probably longer than what it should be, but I just wanted to add some cool, um, you know, creative ways you could use it. You know, I like to offer you guys some value and all that stuff. So with that said, thank you for watching guys. I'll see y'all in the next video and that's that.